Welcome St. Michael's School to our farm, Glessing Family Farm, with our family blessings. I'm Sina, and this is Cora. And I'm Dan, I'm Sina's husband. My name's Wyatt. I'm almost nine. I'm in third grade. I'm Mason. I'm seven and I'm in second grade. I'm Tana. I'm in kindergarten and I'm five. This is a farm that I grew up on. Uh, my grandmother still lives in this house behind us at 92 years old. Uh, they moved here in the 60s, and I farm with my dad uh, on this farm, as well as we have another farm. I'm Alan Glessing, been the farmer all my life. Milk cows 55 years. I don't milk much anymore. Once in a while, I do a little bit, but not a lot. Um, we're bringing up the fifth generation. When I got done with high school, I decided that farming was what I wanted to do. So I went to Ridgewater College in Wilmer, Minnesota for farm operations and management with a dairy emphasis. Uh, I just felt that I needed to have the basic fundamentals of business as well as animal nutrition and crop science. Uh, that's something that my father's generation wouldn't do. They just learned by doing on the farm, but agriculture's changed so much that it's something that I felt I needed uh, to be successful on this farm. Farmed with my dad like Dan and I are doing. And then when my dad got older, I uh, leased the personal property from him. And then after a seven year period of making lease payments, it became mine. Um, and then they gifted the, the land that they owned over to me when they were in their 70s. Dad was 75, mom was 74. I grew up in a small town in southwestern Minnesota named Springfield and uh, there my family were dairy farmers and when I graduated from high school I knew I wanted to do something in agriculture and so I went to college at South Dakota State University which is in Brookings, South Dakota and uh, I studied agricultural education to be a high school agriculture teacher. So then when I graduated college, I took my first job teaching high school agriculture at a neighboring town from where we lived, Asa Kokato. And uh, then we met each other and I really realized that I love dairy farming and, and wanted to raise a family on a dairy farm. And uh, so I was blessed to meet the charming dairy farmer of the area. I now teach at the local high school here, just two miles from our farm. And uh, it's called Howard Lake Waverly Winstead High School where I teach grades nine through 12. And I teach everything about plants and animals. And then I also teach the cooking classes too to the high school students. And so we, we work with everything from farm to fork. I also work with the Princess K of the Milky Way program. Uh, princess K is our state dairy princess. And uh, each year, right before the state fair, we crown a new dairy princess. And then during the state fair, they get their heads carved into 90 pound blocks of butter, which back in the 90s, I even was able to have my likeness carved into butter. And uh, maybe at some point we can get Princess Kay of the Milky Way to visit your school. 